As several fire and police departments around the DMV continue to deal with staffing shortages, 7 News is digging into the challenges that these first responders are facing. It comes after an Arlington County fire truck was temporarily taken out of service because of a lack of staffing. Nick Minock is live in Ballston with what's being done to address these shortages. Nick. Hey Scott, this is one of the most critical county services in Arlington, yet the firefighters union told me here in Arlington that they are grappling with a severe staffing shortage, and that is being driven by unprecedented vacancies and a reduction in employees. On Sunday, engine 102 in Boston was taken out of service due to a severe firefighter shortage. There was nobody else left. So the, the engine company had to go out of service. Brian Lynch is the president of Arlington County's Firefighter Union. Lynch told 7 News the department has 35 vacancies. So that's over 10% of our folks. Our, our positions are vacant. The reason is we can't recruit and retain firefighters with compensation the way it's currently structured. And he says the high cost of living is having an impact on firefighters and current wages at the Arlington County Fire Department are not competitive nationally or regionally. On top of that, he says current firefighters are working mandatory overtime. We have people working up to 72 hours in a row, which is something we never even allowed before. Today, I requested interviews with all the elected officials on the Arlington County Board to ask them questions on what they're going to do to solve the problems with the staffing shortage at the fire department. All the elected officials declined to do an interview with 7 News and take questions on camera. Instead, Arlington County Board Chair Libby Garvey sent 7 News a statement claiming there was no impact to services when Engine 102 was taken out of service, and she listed what the board has already passed to address recruitment and retention. And some of the items that the Arlington County Board Chair mentioned in her email to 7 News is that the board passed hiring bonuses and retention bonuses. Despite the board's efforts, however, we did see a whole fire truck taken out of service. So there's certainly a lot of questions on the long term impact the staffing crisis is having on the fire department. Reporting live in Boston, Nick Minock, 7 News.